We do have coyotes in the city. They come in through the creek. They're not in high numbers, but they're certainly around. With a huge number of rabbits around, there's gonna be more resource and more coyotes will make their way into the city to look after those things. Now, with all due respect, they'll also look after uh, stray cats, um, small dogs that aren't on a leash, et cetera, et cetera. They won't hurt people. They're very nervous of us. So it's not anything that would be dangerous. Yesterday in Saskatoon, where there is quite a few rabbits as well, and there's a wildlife biologist who catches them and transports them out of town. Basically then what we're doing is we're taking them out of town to feed them to the coyotes that are out of town. Is And again, there's a large cost to that. So why not let the coyotes come to us for free as opposed to take the rabbits to them, which costs us something. As a taxpayer, I would like the city to spend its money making good roads, good bus routes, uh, those sorts of things. Culling costs money. As a biologist, I know that once you start that to, to keep the problem from ever being present, you have to continue to do that. You can't stop doing it because as you do it, what will happen is it will make rabbits reproduce earlier, reproduce more. So the far easier way is to spend a little bit more money and protect the trees and the shrubs that you want protected so that the rabbits can't take advantage of that resource. The other option, which I know will make some people not happy, but from a biology point of view, rabbits are tasty. So if we're going to grow all these rabbits, why not take advantage and use them? Um, whether it be for the food bank or teaching people how to butcher rabbits and sell them um, so that you recover uh, money from uh, a human point of view that pays for the rabbit program would be another option. At times, I think we are way too human-centered and we don't think about the other things that are around us. I think those other things around us make our city a better place, make it a more attractive place, and that we should just realize, let's live in harmony and, and just get along and not worry about it a whole lot.